the real causes of blackheads and clogged pores, and how to get rid of them. Sebaceous glands naturally make oil to moisturise and protect your skin, but sometimes skin cells don't shed properly and they become sticky, trapping oil inside a pore, which then turns black as it oxidises, forming what we would call a blackhead. The black part you see isn't dirt, it's just your skin's oil getting stuck in the pore and turning dark when it hits oxygen. You may also get whiteheads, pimples or redness when bacteria gets trapped underneath. Although certain topical skin creams can help, they do not fix the root cause of the problem, so no matter how many times you squeeze those blackheads out, they will keep coming back especially around the nose and T-zone where the pores are naturally larger. So today we'll look at the real root causes of these blackheads and clogged pores and how to truly fix them with natural remedies. Cause number one is a vitamin A deficiency. The absolute most unrecognised cause of blackheads, pimples and whiteheads is a simple vitamin A deficiency. Vitamin A ensures your body makes smooth, flat, healthy skin cells, but when you're deficient in it, the skin cells don't flatten properly, so they become sticky and they clump together. This is what originally clogs up the pores and causes that oil to get trapped. The real active version of vitamin A is only found in fatty foods. This is why going on a low-fat diet often causes poor skin quality. So to correct this, simply start eating more beef, liver, egg yolks, grass-fed butter and oily fish like mackerel, sardines and cod liver oil to boost your vitamin A intake. Over time, as your skin naturally sheds, this nutrient will help to smooth out the skin cells and control oil production. The second root cause of blackheads is having weak liver or bile flow. Your liver can become clogged up with fat when you eat junk foods, alcohol or sugar, which prevents the normal release of bile. This is the digestive fluid that helps you absorb vitamin A, D, E, K and some other nutrients which are good for your skin. This is why many people who have liver disease often have dry, flaky skin with redness or blemishes around their face. You can improve the health of your liver by drinking apple cider vinegar, lemon juice and eating sulphur rich foods. Later I'll be sharing a foolproof set of steps that you can use to clear these blackheads more permanently. Cause number three of blackheads is using harsh soaps and cleansers. You may think that you're helping clear oil from your skin using cleansers and soaps, but actually you're unknowingly making the problem worse by stripping away the skin's natural barrier. This makes it harder for your skin to naturally exfoliate and easier for the dead skin cells to gunk up and clog up the pore. So instead of scrubbing, overwashing and cleansing, focus on fixing the problem internally with your diet. Which leads me on to cause number four, eating low quality fats. The oil that's made by your skin to protect it is made from fats that you consume in your diet. So if you're eating unstable, highly oxidised seed oils like sunflower, soybean, canola or corn oil, the oil within your skin becomes very sticky, inflammatory and glue-like which can worsen those blockages in your pores. This can also create a perfect breeding ground for bad bacteria and yeasts to infect your skin. These seed oils are very inflammatory and they can also clog up your liver which again links back to blackheads. So start cooking healthier meals at home with more skin friendly, stable fats like raw coconut oil, extra virgin olive oil or grass fed beef tallow which is amazing for the skin. Now we'll go a little deeper now into cause number 5, high androgens. Have you noticed that breakouts and blackheads are far more common in teenagers? Well, this is because during puberty they tend to have higher levels of androgen hormones. These cause the oil glands to grow larger and make thicker, waxier oil that clogs up the pores. But it's not just puberty that does this. High levels of insulin from eating junk foods and sugar can raise androgens. High levels of stress can do it or even having a fatty liver, which again ties back into what we talked about earlier. 
Shortly, I'll be giving you a quick action plan to help balance out these hormones and fix the root causes. But before that, you must also understand the importance of zinc. Zinc is the master skin regulator that most people forget about completely. Zinc helps to prevent androgen hormones becoming out of balance, and it also helps to regulate oil production. You also need it to transport and activate vitamin A so that your skin cells shed properly without clumping together. What's more, zinc is antibacterial and it helps to destroy bacteria that causes acne and boils and assists in keeping things moving through the liver for overall health. To get more zinc, simply start eating more shellfish or take a daily supplement. How to get rid of blackheads naturally at this stage, you should have a good understanding about the problems that are really causing those blackheads. So now we'll be looking at some holistic and natural ways to get rid of them for good by fixing the root causes. 1. Stop making the problem worse. Remove the things that cause sticky cells, thick oil and blocked pores. Cut out seed oils, junk foods, take out sugar and refined carbs and stop squeezing or pulling out your blackheads, which is only causing more damage. 2. Clean out the old blackheads. To remove the old ones, use steam to soften trapped oil, followed by a clay mask to draw it out. Then massage a warm, damp cloth in small circles to lift out the blackheads. Let your skin do the work, don't force it. Over time, they will all come out. 3. Regulate oil production. Start to balance the hormones and the systems that control your skin's oil glands. Eat more zinc-rich foods or take zinc glycinate every day to lower DHT and androgens. Cut back on snacking to lower insulin. You may want to drink lemon balm tea to reduce stress and also support your liver by eating more cruciferous vegetables, sulfur-rich foods and apple cider vinegar. These foods help to trigger bile flow that help you absorb vitamin A and detoxify poisons that can weaken your skin. 4. Repair skin cell turnover. Make sure dead skin cells shed properly instead of clumping up and blocking your pores in the future. You can do this by getting lots of real vitamin A by eating beef liver, egg yolks and grass-fed butter. To take it to the next level, you can use virgin cod liver oil supplements and add fermented foods like sauerkraut and kefir to improve the gut-skin axis. Over time, your pores will stop getting clogged up as your skin gets healthier. 5. Protect the pores from oxidation. Stop the oil in your skin from getting trapped and turning black in the future. Do this by eating more antioxidant-rich foods like berries, olives, rosemary and dark greens drinking green tea or hibiscus tea to calm down inflammation from the inside out. And if you'd like to take it a step further, apply niacinamide cream, green tea extract or a tiny amount of annatto extract on your skin to stop skin oil from oxidizing. 20 minutes of sun exposure per day also raises vitamin D to balance out hormones. 6. Keep it simple and consistent. Try not to overload your skin, just stay consistent with the basics. Drink clean water with a tiny pinch of sea salt every day to boost hydration and minerals. Sleep well and eat real food 80% of the time and your skin will thank you. I'm Ryan, a nutritionist from the UK and I've been making these videos with my wife for 9 years. Thank you so much for watching, I wish you great health, wealth and happiness.